Cam um, Ophidiosis. It is the month of love. It is the month of February. Welcome, Ophidiosis. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, let's see what's happening. All right. So happy Valentine's to all you Ophidiosis. Remember, the reading is um, for people that was born November 29th until December 17th. Okay. So Ophidiosis, uh, some ending is here debt and, and ending so whatever that has been happening and transpired i see um debt and the ending is coming up for you ophiosis how is it going to be affecting you ophiosis um is in different different ways um and um you're going to be recognizing um that some sort of a unfair game is now showing up. So are you Ophios as a part of this or you are ending this? And that is what is happening. All right. So what we see is that some of you Ophiosis have uh, make sure that you resolve some sort of a situation for a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. Um, you recognize that this, this person lives overseas. And what is happening and transpiring is that uh, you make sure um, to create some sort of a new start for this person. It is an older lady. It's a lady 50 years and older. This person lives in another country. You recognize some sort of an unfair game that was created around this person. And you make the right decision and give this lady a new start and a new contract because you recognize it, that people had created some sort of a horrible, horrible play against this lady. So this is wonderful, obvious. Maybe it's your mom. Some of you, if your mom is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn and live in another country, I see um, you are going to be really working together, communicating with your mom or your grandmother. I see some sort of a new start is going to be coming in for you and this person because uh, um, you help this person out of a situation. Um, it can be a family member. It's coming up as a mother and that sort of a thing. All right. So we're going to be um, looking what is coming up. So what we have in your foundation is that conflicts um, a lot of conflicts and competition was here. Um, it is now over. Your worries is now over. And I see multiple opportunities is going to be coming in for you because a lot of people is going to be recognizing who you Ophiosis are. Okay. So it was that some of you Ophiosis have some sort of a conflicts, some sort of a conflicts that was career and have you in some sort of a worried situation and now it is over and you're going to be finding um, positive emotional feelings again. So whatever the conflicts, the competition is and was, this is now over. Your worries is over. Emotional stability is here again. Um, as we look at the top in the first week, we have um, some sort of a legal issue that some of you Ophiosis was having with a Leo. Some sort of a conflict, it is now over. In the second week, I see that you're finding strength to deal with some sort of a situation in another country, some sort of a um, or deceptive play that people as create, and you're standing your ground. Uh, in the third week, light has been shed on a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and you're no longer worried. Um, in the fourth week, I see some of you are dealing with relationship and I see some of you wants to, um, a new start with your ex-wife or ex-husband. I see a lot of you recognize that this is the person, this is the love of my life. And I see that you are worried, um, worried about this person. Um, and some of you who were married to a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman, um, that come from another country, you were worried, 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 but now you, your worries is going to be over because you're going to be recognizing that things is going to be working out for this person. So, um, let's, uh, um, look and see what is going on. So that's an end. So something is coming to an end. 
I saw another six. I saw another six. Okay, so that is going to be coming up to an end. <clears throat> um, a legal situation that was going on, uh, a long drawn out legal situation um, is going to be coming to an end. Um, I see justice came in and is ending. <clears throat> um, there is no win for a Leo. Whoever this Leo is, justice came in on this Leo. They're going to be ending some sort of a contract for a Leo. Um, they recognize that this Leo have got some sort of a contract and documentation on the false pretend. And they are going to be ending a contract for a Leo. Some sort of a Leo <coughs> sorry, issue that you guys have with a Leo is going to be ended. People are recognizing that the information that the Leo have is for an old Taurus a Virgo or Capricorn woman that live overseas. And a lot of you Ophiosis is recognizing that a Leo had lied. And you're going to be directly ending the contract of this Leo. And it's going to be um, returning the information to a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn person and give this person a new start because you have recognized what a Leo has done and how a Leo has gotten some sort of a travel documents uh, that was not um, theirs. It was for a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman. I see that this has been a long drawn out case that some of you Sagittarius uh, Ophiosis have been dealing with for a very, very long time. A very long uh, drawn out case where a Leo has created some sort of a conflicts and copy some sort of a travel document for from a old woman a hold of um, Taurus Virgo Capricorn woman and now is recognizing the real um, deceptiveness that was created and you're ending this. So I see the words is now over. Um, I, you are now finally recognizing that um, Aaliyah has gotten you in some serious, serious situation where you could have have uh, and, and, and is as if you have been investigating this Leo for a very, very long time. And there is no win for this Leo. And this there's no win for this conflicts. You are so happy that this is now over because it was creating um, a sleepless night. Being worried about the situation and trying to recognize who was speaking the truth. And now you recognize that a Capricorn, Taurus or Virgo person was speaking the truth. And um, strength. In the second week, a lot of you are trying to find strength. Um, you get some sort of an ending. Um, that some sort of a ending came in. And you're finding strength to deal with um, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn uh, emotions. Is this person is emotion? Um, not really. I see it is more of positive emotion. Um, you are recognizing that some unfair game has been played against this person and um, you are ending this unfair game and you're finding strength to, um, to really um, get over some foolish game that was played in the past and you're really, you know, bringing an end to it um, and you're making sure that a situation is now final and that is good. Okay, so it's something that some of you uh, or, or really whatever is happening and transpiring, you recognize that some unfair game was played and now it is finally over. And it could have affect a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person very badly. Whoever this person is, if this person could be um, from another country or another place and you're recognizing um, what was going on. Third week, light is going to be shedding. Um, there's a lot of conflicts, a lot of conflicts in another country, another city, another place. And you, Ophiosis, uh, are really recognizing, but I see some sort of a new start is going to be coming in. And you're going to be making sure it's as if you're protecting a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn because you recognize what they have done to this person. 
and the, the, the conflicts, the conflicts, conflicts, um, light has been shed on a Leo and a, and a Aries and their trauma documents is being canceled. People are canceling the travel documents of an Aries and a Leo because you recognize and you have evidence that these people have got travel documents on the false right? and they use a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn information to get it. And I see you Ophiosis are going in and you're canceling, canceling, canceling. Um, ending these travel documents for Leo, ending the travel documents for a cancer, ending the travel documents for Aries, because you recognize these people have used an uh, old Taurus, uh, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn information in order to get some sort of a travel documents and you are canceling it and you're, um, canceling it and making sure you prepare a new one. For a, Taur a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman. I see you're seeing some sort of a, a dishonesty. And the light is now shed. And uh, um, you're protected. It's as if you Ophiosis are protecting an old Capricorn person. Because you recognize uh, the real horrible play. It's like this lady is in, in another country. And you're recognizing the real horrible play that they have done. A Cancer, a Aries and a Leo have done to an old Capricorn woman and you're canceling their document. You're like, no, 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 no. These, all these people, the cancer document, the Leo document, the Leo man and Frau document and the Aries document, cancer, N, N, N. It is not their information. The information is for an old Taurus, where we're a Capricorn woman who live overseas. And I see you finally, 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 I see the worries for this lady is going to be over because uh, they, you have recognized how horrible this lady was treated unfair. And um, it's as if you decided this is unfair. This woman has no one else um, to support her, basically. And uh, this lady is working hard and trying to create her stability and wealth. And these people have been using and profiting, accessing documentation and profiting, and you're bringing it to an end. Then we see the energy of the lovers, new contract. A lot of you wants to reconnect with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. Um, is this your mom? I see you're open to reconnect and, and, and heal with this person because you have recognized you want to connect and really connect with this person, really heal with this person because you recognize what family I've done to this person. And, um, you know, I, I see that some of you were married to this person and people have created issue for you and this person and you want a new start with this person because you recognize that this person um, make your heart flutter. And I see that you're going to be protecting this person with all your might. Whatever the reason is, I see you recognize that this person had a good heart. However it is coming up, you you you, you know um and uh, see you're thinking and i see you want a new start with this person but you don't know because you you guys have become so um, good friends you don't want to like uh rough the feathers you recognize yeah you know you know we have been such good friends so um you know but emotionally you your emotional is balanced with this person it's as if you know, I'm not seeing this person every day, but my heart, my heart chakra is good with this person. A lot of you are going to be wanting um, some sort of a new start. If you were in a relationship with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, I see you're going to be wanting some sort of a new start. I see some of you are going to be creating a new start for this person, creating new contracts for this person because you recognize how unfairly this person was treated so positive emotion you end a month with a very very positive emotion um an end is coming in some sort of a news an end is coming in um some of you are trying to find strength to, to deal with a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn person you did not success overcome this person 
and there was some sort of a legal issue and you weren't successful. I see this person stood their ground and showed up some sort of a information that people were not aware of. And uh, you were like, oh my God, I never knew that. So it was as if some of you, of you says, uh, um, an end came and you, you were not successful with a legal suit against a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person because uh, information came out um, about a cancer and a Leo and with their travel documents, you're like, Jesus, I was on the wrong team or Jesus, wow, what had, had happened and transpired. So a legal situation is coming to an end. Um, you did not win this case, Ophiosis light shed some sort of a light shed um over a taurus Virgo, or a capricorn person and your worries is now over okay a lot of you are thinking of a new start a lot of you obvious is want some sort of a new start your worries is now over um you didn't win but you are finding strength to, to move on and create some sort of a Heal your relationship, heal your marriage. So some of you could have been like um, investigating a case. Some of you could have been placed to investigate someone, investigate a case. And uh, you were placed outside in another country um, to investigate someone. And uh, um, Yeah, uh, it is now over because you you recognize that this uh, whoever the Star Wars Virgo or Capricorn is, uh, it's a tough cookie to crack. But you recognize that the person was being honest. <laughs> um, I see you're going to be having some sort of a friendship bond. This is good, a real good friendship bond. I see healing of emotion is here. So a lot of you Ophiosis is healing your emotions. Um, yep, you're healing your emotion, maybe with a mother that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn, um, or with your ex fro that is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn, you're healing your emotion. You didn't really win, but you're healing your emotion with this person. This is a time of following your heart and feel the fullness of your emotion. You may feel so compelled to nurture others that you forget to nurture yourself. Flashes of intuition provide you with increased insight. You or another person is a kind person, tender-hearted, loving, and trustworthy friend. So I, I, I see that some of you, um, Ophiosis, honestly recognize the truth about a person and recognize that this person have no heart, nothing. Um, you know, this person is uh, so honest and it could be also you Ophiosis that recognize Jesus. This person is just so pure. Um, this person just, you know, they really stand up for equality and injustice. And this person is in your reading. So uh, go and think about who is this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person because somehow they're connected to you or some of you could be investigating this person. I recognize that this person is so honest and really emotionally they're good balance um okay and some of you were worried about this person it could have been your mother or your wife in an, another country or this person is from another country you were worried and now you're going to be recognizing hey they're okay you know the the issues the problem that was going on they are okay and people are recognizing this and i see that some of you are recognizing that this person is okay and you're letting it go because you recognize that the person whoever had lied and created issue around this person wasn't speaking the truth and you are balancing this out and is recognizing that you have met someone with some sort of a pure heart and that is good i gotta go show your love by thumbs up and i love you guys namaste